Hi guys, so if you are getting this uh, kmode exception not handled etd.sys error, you can easily fix this. So for that, let's move to a method of fixing this error. Uh, make sure that your uh, uh, laptop or PC is fully turned off. Now we will boot into automatic recovery mode. So how to boot into automatic recovery mode? First we will start this computer with a power button and as soon as the logo of the manufacturer appears on the screen, we will again press the power button and press it for two to three seconds and so that it gets turned off forcefully okay now we'll repeat this process two to three times and uh, until the automatic repair mode uh, starts showing on the screen so let's start first we'll uh, press the power button and as soon as the logo start appearing we'll press the power button and keep it pressed for three to four seconds now again do this process as soon as the logo appears okay again start the computer Let's do, do the process once again. Now see, this is what we are looking for, preparing automatic repair screen. Okay, so once this appears on the screen, we need not press the power button again. Now once we reach this screen, what we have to do, we have to click on advanced options. Okay, Let's click on advanced options. Now we will click on troubleshoot. Now we will click on advanced option again. And now what we have to do is to click on startup settings. Now we'll click on restart. Now we'll uh, either press four or five to go to safe mode or safe mode with networking. Okay. Now we will enter the password and now when we will log in, we will log in into the safe mode. Now as we have entered the safe mode on our computer, we will press Windows and R key together from our keyboard. Now this will appear. Now we will type msconfig and now click on OK. Now once this screen has been reached, we will click on services and now it is alphabetically listed okay shorted now uh, just search elan services in the list okay if you can find elan services in the list then it's okay we have to uncheck that services if we find elan services just uncheck the service if we do not find elan services we have to uh, find touch keyboard and handwriting service okay this is the service okay just uncheck this now click on apply and now click on okay and now click on restart and now you can uh, get back your PC again 